Hey guys, what's up? This is Cameron with Sam's Survival 7. And uh, today, got a really rainy day, so just thought I'd do a video. Um, let my boat clean off and stuff. So, do a video over my 10 foot drum boat. And, um, you know, like the mod, the modifications I've done to it and everything. So, uh, uh, so let's get started. Um, well, first, you know, as you might notice, uh, I've camoed it, um, because, you know, without the camo, it's just, you know, dark green, so, um, you know, basically, I just used, a uh, tan, um, tan, green, and, uh, let's see, brown spray paint, um, and I just got some stencils from around my neighborhood, so, um, I got, uh, a cattail, kind of, you know, the cattail tops, and, uh, I just used a net just to take up space and stuff, and, uh, just some willow leaves and some cattail stalks as well. I think it looks pretty nice, um, if you step away a little bit, I think it looks pretty good, kind of blends in around, uh, place I fish, so... Next, um, these are probably one of the most useful things I've ever, you know, had on my boat. Just some simple eye bolts. You know, these are great for tying your anchor off too, because I always have my anchor right there. Got an extra carabiner as well. I got, you know, four of those on each corner, you know. And, um, great, great thing. You just, you know, drill hole, uh, you know, put a... Uh, put a washer right there and then a, you thread the nut up on up under it that just keeps it nice and snug great for tying off the docks and such you know like I said tying your anchor so um, next um, and these are really good to have um, like not no slip no slip tape or whatever <laughs> um, really good you know uh, one right there there same on the other seat, three strips right there, two strips here, there for your feet, two feet, two right here for uh, the battery, and uh, three up here for stepping on stuff, and strip right there as well. So, um, I think this is, you know, mainly the other, the last mo uh, modification I've done to my boat. Um, I think this is a two inch uh, schedule 40 PVC pipe and just some kind of U clamps I think they might call them and uh, some self tapping screws out there. Um, I'm gonna make those a lot better because they're just kind of thrown together pretty quick. I'm gonna make those a lot better but they work for now you know. That's the main thing is you know they work. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to put some PVC pipe rod holders horizontal. Um, with my boat on the seat, so um, hopefully that'll be pretty good. Um, really, the only uh, thing that's gone wrong with my boat is I've oh, almost fell. That's embarrassing. Yeah. <laughs> is um, I've I've uh, I've got a hole in my boat. Um, it's up here somewhere. I don't know where it is. Um, I think it might be in there or something, but. I got that hole from setting my ba my boat on my battery, and um, yeah, it, it sparked, and I'm like, whoa, dad, there's a hole or something. <laughs> I don't remember, it was a long time ago, but we just patched that up with some JB Weld, and uh, you know, really quick, and I'm going to put some silicone on there as well, so very, very good boat, um, I've loved it, you know, so far. It's a little small, you know, but you the one thing you gotta, you know, realize is you can't bring a crap load of stuff with you when you go fishing. I mean, it's great for, like, one person. With two people, it's a little crowded, but it's alright, you know. Um, me and my friends stand up in it right here, and we fish. Um, so, it's pretty stable, you know. I've never flipped it over or anything. But, uh, yeah just kind of like a walk around I guess 
um, that's my dad's boat right there. He never goes out on it, but it's a uh, it's a Pelican ten foot plastic boat or something. Um, it's really muddy here. The drainage creek. That's the front right there. So, you know, like I said, really good boat. Um, I might upgrade, you know, when I get the money, which won't be anytime soon, but, um, yeah, one last thing, let me just, uh, show you my deck that I built for it. It's up here on my patio. There's my dog, Scout, in my crate, or in his crate. Um, just so you wouldn't get my way, but this is my deck right here. Carpeted it with indoor outdoor carpet. These are like one one buys. Just pieces of wood screwed on, you know, on the three sides. And this uh this just kinda I don't know if you can see it, it just it just sits right there, alright? Um one inch schedule 40 PVC pot cut so it'll snap on to the little Oh, I don't know what you call them, little, you know, sides of the boat, made out of, uh, scrap, uh, plywood, you know, my dog tore it up, I'm just gonna have to put some staples in it, or whatever, screws maybe, but, yeah, it's up here, hopefully staying pretty dry, I got the carpet for free from my grandpa, I got the, um, the plywood for free as well from my neighbor, so, yeah, uh, I'll just kind of show you where that goes on and how it stays on to my messy yard. <laughs> um, so remember we had two pieces. You guys didn't see the other piece, but two pieces of PVC pipe cut and they just kind of snap on just kind of like that and it sits right there. We put one self-tapping screw right here so it wouldn't slide back and the same for the other side right there. It, really good deck you can put the heads of your paddle up under there and then on top of the metal deck and under the carpeted deck but yeah um i hope you guys enjoy this video my last video i shot it in the dark just because it's really bored and i really wanted to do a video over that um i'll have some videos this summer um fishing out of my boat and stuff so hopefully you guys um you know enjoy this video Excuse me. Enjoy this video and uh, comment, rate, and subscribe if you want to. Thanks, guys.